Hi there. Um, I was just wondering if you could um, actually describe your first meeting with Mark Zuckerberg. You know, he was 19 years old. Uh, he was uh, he was very um, introverted and rather quiet at the time. He still is somewhat introverted. Uh, he, um, you know, it, it seemed like the, the we we had done a lot. Um, my friend Reed Hoffman and I uh, had done a lot of homework on the whole social networking space. Um, you know, Reed had started a company called SocialNet all the way back in 1997, seven years earlier, uh, and so we had thought about this a lot and. Um, and so it, it actually didn't depend that much on what happened in the meeting at all. We were going to invest just about no matter what. So we had the meeting for an hour, and then we wrote the check. But uh, we had we'd done our homework uh, beforehand. Um, I, I think the the odd question about Facebook that's uh, very hard to get a handle on is uh, why nobody in Boston invested between February of 04 and August 04 when I met them in Silicon Valley. Um, and I have. I have this sort of crazy theory that uh, that um, there's, there's always sort of there always are these competitive dynamics people get caught up in that are that are very unhealthy. And I think one one version of it is that older people um, often don't want younger people to do better than mm. themselves. And uh, and so if you're, uh, I, I think there were these venture capitalists in Boston that uh, were personally annoyed at how well Zuckerberg was going to do. And it sort of stopped them in a way from making the investment. Um, what I told Zuckerberg when I when I made the investment was that I, I sincerely hoped that he would, be far wealthier and far more successful than I had ever been, and I'm very glad that happened. <laughs>